Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Crafty Ella coming at you. And um, before I start, I just want to send um, a lot of prayers to everybody in the Caribbean, Puerto Rico. We have family over there right now and they are going through a devastating, you know, round two storm. We just got hit with Irma two weeks ago. My house is still in shambles and um, we're, we're getting back slowly but slowly. As everybody knows who's gone through a major disaster, it's not the actual event, it's the aftermath. Okay, yes, we're scared, we're boarded up, we don't know what's going on for 12, 14, 36 hours sometimes. You hear things banging and crashing and screaming and nobody knows what's going on until you go outside and then you find out that your house is really damaged. My one wall, we were, we were literally okay, but the back end of my house got the worst part of it and it blew away my fencing, my whole back patio area. So all of that stuff is sitting in my living room right now until we could get that put back up. And um, it sh uh, shimmied one of my top windows, so the um, water was coming in. Since it was hitting it from the east, it came in and it ran down the wall. So my upstairs and downstairs back wall is all bubbled. They're going to come and cut it out and then redo everything there. But um, it's nothing compared to what the people on the islands are getting. So my prayers are for everybody that's out there in the path of this storm and who's been in the path of the storm here in Florida there's still people that don't have power we were lucky we got our power back in five days if you can call that luck but um, we live close to FIU where there's a lot of students and it was a shelter um, all the evacuees from the Keys came to FIU, so I mean, I guess that's why we lucked out and got power in five days. Plus, there's a police station right across the street. So, having said that, my house looks like a hurricane actually is in it. Because all of my patio and deck stuff is behind my couch over there. All of my crafting stuff is in the process of being um, still settled in and where my dining room is so it's just I've got wood everywhere I have plywood everywhere that we took down and um, I was getting cabin fever from being boarded up and um, having power but still not being able to see anything and I hadn't been out and yesterday I sat here with my little table watching TV and I was crafting and um, Somebody came on from Florida and said that grab bags were still around. Now, the Michaels that's close to me had not opened until I believe it was this past weekend because they had damage and they had no power. So I had to jump in the car and go down to Michaels and look for grab boxes, but ours didn't have boxes. Ours had bags. But as you can see, it's taken over my couch. Now, do you think that I would have just stopped at the grab bags? No. I went for things that were on sale that I knew I wanted to get and I went. But all in all, okay, I spent $56 with everything. Grab bags and stuff included. $56. So, I mean, I think I did humongously well I was blessed and then um, we went to dinner at Outback because it's in that same shopping center and we had a lovely steak and lobster dinner I'd like to treat ourselves for the first time being out you know from all of this stuff and eating you know just canned foods and stuff so in that same shopping center there's a Joann's and there's a Big Lots yeah I went to both of them. Um, Joann's was having a nice clearance rack in the front. I did not make it to the dollar stuff that was on, in the back because it was getting late and um, I was starting to poop out because of my chemo. So I just said, okay, that's it. I've done enough today and I left. 
So with everything that I bought in all the stores, I spent $75. So I think I did really, really good. And when you see the stuff that I got, you know, you're gonna be amazed too. And I was praying that in mine, I didn't get all of those glass containers and vases that people were getting, the green and the blues and stuff like that. Cause I, I don't care if it costs $50, $100 or anything like that. I think they were ugly. And even if it was for free, I wouldn't even give it to somebody because I thought they were so ugly. But for those of you who got not one, but two, but three, but four, you know, more power to you, you know, pass it on unless you live in Florida and you have a beach scene. But to me, I just thought they were bulky and it wasn't my style. So I'm praying that none of that is in here. So I've got my humongous cup of coffee. I've got one of my beautiful candles that I got yesterday from um, Michael's and this is Cozy Lodge and it's just so beautiful and I'm just gonna jump in. I don't know where we're going but we're jumping in. Let's start with this first bag. I was gonna take everything out of the bag so that we wouldn't be crinkling but then I thought it would not have all the fun parts so I didn't do it. Okay, in this bag, I have more wrapping paper with the shoes on it. Now, I bought this for a quarter, like um, a month ago, that it was on clearance in the dollar bin, so I got some of these for a quarter, so for free, it's better. I got a, a bag. I'll take it. I got some... Uh, I guess playing cards are in there somewhere. I got more of these papers. Now what I've done with these, and I'll, and I'll bring the tutorial to you, is I've made little memo uh, packets with these. Let's see. There's a pack of the cards, the big cards, and this is what they look like. This is the pineapple, but they are actually cards, and this has the seahorse. I did buy a few of these for my grandchildren, so I'm glad I got more of those. I got a Lion King wooden little plaque, painting plaque, and this was regularly $2.99. Oh, I got some tissue paper, very good, $3.99, and it's the red with the white and red polka dots. A Zimba paddle ball that I will not be giving to my grandchildren. I got um, some stickers, treat yourself, happiness is sweet, here's the scoop, eat more ice cream, more sprinkles and sweet ideas, $1.50, so that was a good deal. Come on, boo, get up here. I got Hooray to You cards, and these are from the $1.50 bins there, and I do... Um, cover, redecorate, and then repurpose these. So I'm, I'm glad I got those. Disney Family Crafts. This is, oh, this my, my grandchildren will love. They have to stick the little um, sparkles to the, to the image. Oh, I hope I, I got more of those. Let's see. Oh, I got another one. This one is um, Simba, and it's got the pom-poms. Remember, I got 10 grandchildren. More of the cards. Best day ever. And these come with, um, how many? Six pieces for $1.50 normally. So that was good. Another pack. Hooray for you. And even if I don't use the cards, I use the envelopes. So, you know, that was a good deal. This, I guess this is, um... I have no idea who he is. It's a Disney character, so I'm going to go with Thumper. If this is Thumper, it's a mask that the children can color. Um, more stickers. These are Molly and Rex, regularly $3.99. And these, you amaze me. Thank you. You're wonderful. And they're the gold foil. So that was cute for $3.99. Then, 
I got a, what is this? A letter. A gold T. Do I have any grandchildren with T in their name? Last name, yes. Aw, oh, now this is cute. It's a little Finding Nemo banner that the kids can put together. And it says it's got six felt shapes, four cardstock shapes, 60 inches of baker's twine, 36 sticky back rhinestones, and the instruction sheet. $7.99. So I thought that was a good deal. I got excited about that. Star Wars. Oh, my grandson's going to like this. Now, let me see what it is before I get excited about it. It is a... I have no idea. It's R2-D2. Handle and line included. Oh, it's a kite. An R2-D2 kite. So, he'll like that for my oldest one. He'll like that one. I got... Uh, 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 uh. Don't fall, don't fall. More cards. Find your, find your happy, happy hello. Um, let's see, let's see. More happy hello. And these are eight. And they're just the green and white. Now, I think that's cute. You can, that has a lot of possibilities. And then the envelopes are the same way. Okay, now I'm getting excited because I prayed that I would get, well, let me finish. Treat yourself. Six pieces. Pretty glittery cards. Um... I keep getting these in all my grab bags. I guess they don't sell and they just throw them in there. It is a plaster flower for $5.99. And I have no idea what to do with it, but I did do a placard to put outside and I E6000 it to it outside because that's the only place that I would put that. So I did that. I got some dead flowers so that's pretty I can use that outside also um, moving on up here let's see I got what is this this is a table runner a black and white polka dot table runner now this is going to be good when I host Bunko again next year I'm going to use that for that because I do pink black and white then we got a Backyard Fun Amusement Stunt Ribbon. Okay, oh, I guess it's one of those twirly things that the kids could play with. Three bucks. So that's cute. Stocking stuffers always come in handy. I got two of those, so that's good. I got a wooden meow sign. Now, you know that's going to go great with him. So, I don't know what I'm going to do with that. I, I usually turn these over when I get them in the grab bags and I just use them for containers. So, that's an idea for you guys if you don't want to repurpose them. I got some neon sidewalk paint. So, again, stocking stuffers. My daughter's going to hate me. I got another one of those. I got... A neon colored football I think I got a lot of those because I know there was a bag that had a lot of these in them and I tried to get 10 of them if I can see something that I really like I try to find the bags that have those in them so I could have enough to give all the kids so getting back to what I thought I was really excited and I hoped and prayed that I would get in my grad bags were these Ringling Brothers anything. Any party supplies from Ringling Brothers because you know they just stopped doing their shows. They just, um, they retired. So anything related to Ringling Brothers is remembers my childhood. 
and a dear friend of ours that just passed a couple years ago, he used to run the trains for Ringling Brothers when they came through uh, Kissimmee. So this is like memorable for me. So um, collector's items maybe or a real pretty Christmas I mean, circus themed party. So I got that. Then these are going directly in the trash. These are candy buttons. Gourmet carnival candy buttons. They're all sugar and nobody in this house needs sugar because we're diabetic and my grandchildren surely don't need no more sugar. They don't get sugar from Ella. So that was one bag. So that was a, a good bag, I must say. A lot of things. I'm very happy with that bag. Now, I want to make sure I don't spill nothing. This This might run into two or three uh videos because i'm coming up on 15 minutes so let's go on oh in that bag there were um some stickers and these are the mermaid themed and there's um two sheets of those four-sided and then the letter a so that's that one okay let's get into this one because this one's like bubbling out at me um these do not do not give up junk food junkie and sweet things i guess these are like little signs you put on your desk it's it says table tents for a dollar fifty so that's okay i guess i guess another pack of these now these are good because this has 80 sheets and if you take like five sheets and you cut them down and you make little packets of 20, you know, for a little notepad and you, and you decorate it, that is really something really cute. That's an idea that I've had and I did start working on for a craft fair. So I'll bring them to you as soon as I get them uploaded. Oh, you're falling, you're falling. Don't fall because I don't know what's in you. Hold on. Let me move my leg. More wrapping paper, and this one again is one that I bought with the little dresses on it. And then this one has the green dresses with the sunflowers. That one I had not bought, so I am happy for that. Glow Flying Ring. Okay. You say so. Glow Tic Tac Toe. Something to keep the kids busy. Another T. Can we say three T's? Well, my kids, my children's last names are Tamayo, so that would be, I guess, good for them. More cards. Happy hello. Uh, now, this is pretty, a tiny treasure. And it says Halloween on it, but it's a little cross with a flower on it. So I think that's cute. It's a little embellishment. So I like that. <laughs> More hate from, from my daughter. Sidewalk chalk. You okay, boo-boo? And this is like giant pencils. And it's the purple, the green, the pink, and the uh, orange. So that'll go with their paint. Not at Ella's house, that's for sure. Life is perfect. You know that's got to go because of him. He don't like kitty cats. Actually, he does. He doesn't fight with kitty cats. He don't fight with nobody because he don't know he's a dog. Um, more of those ice cream stickers. Crazy Thankful. I think I lucked out on those. Some pretty just napkins for the bar. I don't care what color they are. When you're drinking, who cares? What is this? Vanilla jasmine diffuser stems. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Um, I like that. Some lace from the dollar fifty, and this is the peach. Like ombre peach into uh, cream and then into white. 
more cards. Now this is the hot dog and it says hello in the mustard and then the um, envelope is actually really cute. It says hot dogs, fresh and hot, fries for guys. Um, what else is in here? Let me see. I guess he wants to come out. A basketball. So that's two balls. Something else is in here. I don't know what it is. More Ringling Brothers cupcakes. And then... Hold on, hold on. <laughs> I guess i am got a cheer sign too. The light up sign. Now this is actually cute. I, um... I think I'm going to put this in my stairway when people are going up. And that will be like a night light up at the top of my stairway. Because it's only batteries. So I think that will be cute. Okay, let's, where am I at? 21 minutes. I think we can get through this one that's coming apart. Okay, let's do this one. This one looks little enough that I can get it in. Okay, here's another one. Cheers. I guess now we can toast. We have two cheers. More cards. Uh, happy hello. Uh, oh, now this is nice. And I think my daughter's going to steal it. It says, hey, hottie. And it's one of the Valentine's Day ceramic glasses. And I know she's going to take it. Um, more little balls. Those you'll get into. Now this says, no cards and envelopes. And it says, hey hottie. It's a tin can. And it has... Oh, now this is cute. Oh, this is an idea also for craft fairs. It's got the cards and then the matching envelopes and they're really pretty in a little thing it's just a plain card it says hey there that's the back of it they're blank and then the um envelopes are like in a not a hot pink but a warm pink maybe so i got one of those i thought there was another one that was falling out <clears throat> Yep, another one of those. So, more Ringling Brothers cupcakes. And this has the, the horse on him. So, I'm really happy for that. Now, this one's a different one. This one says Pretty Girl on it. And let's see what it has in it. Pretty girl, high heel shoes, and the lipstick, and then the pink polka dots in the back. So, I like that. And each of these were $9.99. Really? Come on, Michaels. So, okay. I've got four more bags. So let's cut this one short so I can clean this area off, put it away, and then come back with part two of this mega mess. Um, remember, always say a prayer for somebody who is less fortunate than you. Keep everybody in the Caribbean on your prayer list today. Be crafty. Think of things maybe, you know, if you do cards for charity, just send them over to the Red Cross and just say thinking of you, lift your spirits or something like that. The keys. Um, Texas is still reeling with a lot of stuff. So keep our minds open. We're crafty people. I know we can think of something to send over there just to make them happy. So until then, happy crafting. See you in a little bit. Remember, thumbs up to this video subscribe below i will be doing a giveaway probably by the end of the week so please get me some subbies up there and we will just start giving things away because that's what i like to do just give me a comment 
anything you want to say, anything that you saw in the video, one item that you saw, and you will be entered into the giveaway. So, see you in a little bit. Bye-bye.